All right. Looks like we are recording. What's up, guys? My name is Greg, and uh, here just with a quick unboxing video. Um, if you don't know, I am uh, a photographer. I do it on the side. It's, I get a lot of joy out of doing it. And for the last few months, I've been using my iPad almost exclusively to edit all my photos using uh, Adobe. Um, Adobe Lightroom CC and I love having the ability with like my Apple Pencil being able to specifically touch the parts of the photo that I'm adjusting and uh, Apple just released their new line of their iPad Pro and I've been an iPad user for so long that I thought I would pick it up and so we're gonna unbox it today uh, I'm just gonna share with you kind of my experience first impressions and then uh, if you guys want to see um, a longer video a review from a photographer standpoint of what it's like to edit and use the new iPad Pro uh, let me know in the comments down below and subscribe if you haven't already so let's jump right in all right so I got some stuff here um, got the new pencil because the old pencil doesn't work with the new one that's kind of a bummer um, I got the new keyboard folio so I use this thing um, to write uh, I'm a pastor so I write a lot of my messages on there and then I use the pencil to take notes as well and uh, again the old one doesn't work with the new one so I had to pick up a new one set those things off to the side and uh, we'll deal with this guy first I did get the 12.9 inch yeah the 12.9 inch and uh, I love unboxing Apple products. It's like all of the best experience all wrapped up in one. So we're gonna just tear this guy off. We're gonna do the iPad first because while it's setting up, we can unbox everything else. Boom, pull the tab out. Wow. I'm actually shocked at how thin, thin this feels. I know everyone's made a big deal about how thin this is, but even on camera, I mean, you can see it's it's really thin, but uh, once it's in your hands, it's like next level thin. So that is phenomenal. Okay, let's All right. Sorry, it's probably just blocking the light. So there we go. Got the space gray. And uh, it's really thin. So there's this new smart connector on the bottom. This is where you, uh, the iPad will, or the keyboard will connect. Then on this side, there's a little spot that where the Apple Pencil is supposed to connect. So let's get this guy booting up. There we go. So while this boots, let's open the rest of the stuff. Of course, there's all the other stuff in the box the same stuff you get every time it is USB-C this time which is great it'll work with all my hubs for uh, my Mac but uh, we can look at all of that later if you want let's do the keyboard next man the pencil and everything had a nice little pull tab on it gonna need a knife for this one all right put the knife away so I don't cut myself opens like this. Slide that into there. Oh, it's got the same little pull tab. Helio. Get this guy out of here. It's a little more hefty than I was expecting. Let's see. So this feels feels really similar. It almost has kind of a grayish blue tint to it, but it feels really similar to uh, the last keyboard one, but this one is quite a bit different in the way that it works. You can see on the inside right there, there's the little smart connector point. It feels similar, maybe a little bit more tree, uh, key travel than the last one. Let's get this bad boy in here. So there's supposed to be magnets uh, on here that connect it. I'm assuming it'll find its right spot. Maybe. Oh, definitely just snapped into place. So there is a 
whole thing set up and then the keyboard goes down and this just goes out out so then go into that place or a steeper one that's really steep I don't know when you use that but uh, most times I probably use this closer one and then let's see this thing flips around the back hmm I don't know if I like being able to touch the keyboard like that, but uh, I guess it works. All right, set this aside. We'll finish that later. On to the pencil. Pencil has a nice little pull tab, maybe. Uh, literally just broke right off. All right, let's get the rest of this plastic off of here. Another pull tab. I love the pull tabs. Ooh, it slides out. It's very nice. And then, Apple Pencil. I won't show you the whole thing because they did a graving on the Apple Pencils now. And uh, I thought, in case I lose mine, it'd be really great to engrave my phone number on the side. And as much as I love you, I don't want all of you calling me all the time. So uh, you can see the Apple Pencil here. Hope that focused. I'm missing a monitor. So, uh, like I said, just trying to get this done quick and get this out to you guys. So, uh, passcode. Oh, let's not show you guys my passcode. In theory, this uh, magnetically attaches to the top and it charges. So let's see how well this works. There you go. That is, yeah, that's on there pretty good. So I'm just waiting for this guy to finish setting up the rest of the way. It feels, oh, let's set up Apple Face ID. Ready? Oh. Turn it like this. Get started. All right. Let's face the light. Move your head around. Did one. First scan complete. Move your heads. I'm gonna go the opposite direction. Just see. Complete. All right. That's all set up. Uh, I came from this size last year, uh, and as you can see. The new one's quite a bit bigger, um, but I've always wanted a bigger screen, so I'm hoping this is the right size. Um, you know, I would always suggest getting your hands on any device before you shell out a bunch of money for it, but I was pretty confident this was the size that I was going to want, and uh, so we're gonna give that a shot. And I guess I just have to finish setting this guy up. Um, but anyways, if you guys found that interesting, the kind of first impressions as we unboxed, um, please let me know by hitting a thumbs up and subscribing if you haven't already. If you'd like to see more reviews, if you'd like to see how I edit my photos on an iPad, uh, leave a comment down below. Let me know that's what you're interested in and I'll definitely follow up and make a video about that. Um, but yeah guys, I just wanted to get this done nice and quick and uh, I'm gonna go spend some time drawing and playing on my iPad. So I uh, hope you guys have a good one. Take it easy. Peace.